Today we have a 2008 Ford Taurus with a 3.5. It's a limited model. Um, it has a P102 code, which happens to be your mass airflow sensor. We're going to show you where that's located and how to clean or replace it. This is your Ford 3.5 motor. Your mass airflow sensor happens to be right here. And there is a red safety clip that holds it in place. You just pull that out, and push down on it, and pull it out like that. See right there, you, once you pull that out, you push down on that. These are T20, just go in there, take these out. And make sure you don't drop them. The bottom one down here. remove it just like that all right to uh, clean the mass airflow sensor you have to use uh, something that's made specifically for that and uh, we use this all the time I don't know about their claims about more miles per gallon and all that good stuff but it does seem to work well so what you got to do is you got to clean these little wires in there they get dirt on them and then all of a sudden it won't work properly you can see it better on that side right there and after you clean it like that, we're going to let it set for about 10 minutes. Now you just install it. You can only put it one way. If you put it the other way, the screws and that actually won't line up like that. So you have to put it just like that. Start the screws by hand, which is kind of tough today because a little cold. You don't want to drop them. There's that one. We'll get the other one started in the bottom. down there. I guess I just make sure you don't drop it. So we get those started. We just snug them up. They don't have to go crazy. And I know some people are tempted to clean it with electrical cleaner or brake clean. Don't do that. It leaves a residue on it. So just use the proper fluid and a mass airflow sensor cleaner and you won't have a problem. Okay, tight. Put this on, and once you put that in like that, you lock it with this. So, clicks, lock that, and that's all it takes to do a mass airflow sensor on a 2008 Ford Taurus with a 3.5.